I'm going to show you a quick prompt tip that will let you add a feature to your no code application without breaking the rest of the application. And it will also let you add these features very inexpensively because they're well defined before you start the work. What I want is for all of the output to be in a downloadable markdown file. Right now it comes out as a copy and paste markdown format. So we're going to start a new chat. Here's how we make feature changes without breaking the rest of the application. So we send it this again. I like to say don't make changes and don't make changes. This gives you a session start here so you can always go back. So for each feature change, you do this in a new chat. We're not going to stack a bunch of features in one chat. We do a new chat so we can always go back and undo that feature. This is its plan. Yeah, that looks pretty solid. Okay, here I'm asking it to do the changes, but I'm re iterating that we don't want it to change anything else at all. We have the outline up here of what it's trying to do, primarily in this results display document. So let's see what it starts to modify. Results display, which it said it would do. Okay, it's added a download as markdown. Let's see if it works. So we'll do a test. And here's our PRD. Now this you could copy as normal. We're going to check out the new feature and see if this works. It popped up a download. So I'm going to see if that file is what we need. And it gave us the download. Perfect. So it executed it without changing anything else. The application still works. And we have the ability to download this markdown. So that's how you add a feature without changing anything else using proper instructions. New feature, 25 cents, and we're ready to roll. And that's how it works. A well-defined feature change with just 25 cents in the agent mode of Replit. Please go ahead and give this video a like and give me a follow if you like this sort of content.